it's 10 09 um p.m at night excuse me oh you about to hit me tail lights on the truck. I didn't get it, but I see it. No, no headlights or tail lights. I mean, it's so unfair that the gang stalkers can break the law all day. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. And they do it willfully and knowingly, intentionally. And I mean, it's, and the fake Darnell Williams perp made another fake new harassing account. And um, another criminal, no license plate or head, tail lights. The fake Darnell Williams perp threatened to run me out of Louisiana. You don't have the power or the authority or the right to do that talking about oh you know pretty soon um we're gonna run you out of louisiana so be looking for a new place really soon see look what he did why would you do that to me if look of all the um So it's Wednesday night, right? Yeah, so um So the fake Darnell Williams perp, he left me alone and then once he found out by stalking me, illegally stalking me, found out you know that I got wrongfully arrested, um that's when he started harassing me again. But people, these perps, gang stalkers and police officers, they act like as if they have a license to hypocritically break the law. They really do. They got me out forced out here on the wrong night. Tail lights on the taxi cab. <clears throat> yeah, um. Those cops were, um. They were power hungry and out for my blood. <coughs> Excuse me. I mean, even in Pensacola, African um, stood up to cops, you know. And sometimes they'll even be submissive and back down and leave me alone. <coughs> and look. That's the same car. No headlights or taillights. Like, I'm seeing gang stalkers break the law in my face, in front of my face every day. And I'm going to jail for trying to survive. Strange taillights on the truck. Another a white car with no license plate. They still are not fully um 
don't, I mean, like, they didn't put everything away from fake Mardi Gras. And they still got barricades and everything. So 650 Poydras, that's where the jagging situation, I mean, you know, the jagging incident. And see, these perps are talking freaking loud near me. Um, so, shut the fuck up. These, so 650 Poydras, this is, this is where they had the jagging incident. Um, and this French truck coffee, what was where that guy acted weird towards me? <clears throat> Excuse me. Now you refuse to even let me buy food. <clears throat> I'm glad that somebody told me that he was glad to see. They have a lot of people who say that they're glad to see that that I'm, I seem to be the only real Ti. Oh, Look, strange headlights. So I'm going to be cold for at least eight hours. Hi. when I got raped by the Freemason in 2012 they were they were so close to wanting to wrongfully jail me they they, they wanted to protect and defend the Freemasons so bad So where am I supposed to go? So So like 
the jail, the jail fee or the bond, that's almost two hotel nights. I mean, I mean, almost two hotel nights that I'll be robbed of, or a hundred. I said almost two hotel nights, but or oh, less less money for myself. Excuse me. Excuse me. He got his phone and she aimed at me. <clears throat> so I'm I, I refuse to wear a dirty jacket or a dirty coat. So I have to be forced to um that car was a perp. I have to be forced to um <coughs> excuse me. I have to be forced to be cold. Uh, and I I mean my shirt is dirty. <coughs> Buses I saw had one head like he, that perp right there. That SUV he got um, elbow against the window. <laughs> See the, the the cab got um one tail light brighter than the other. One tail light dimmer than the other four. I mean, dimmer than the other three. <clears throat> so, uh, I mean... The police brutality that I experienced it reminds me so much of the fake foster care abuse. <clears throat> I feel like I can't believe I'm out of jail. I was about to lose my sanity. Look, strange headlights. Stupid. If any, if any real police officer wanted to do their jobs, they would tackle down on gang stalking. They would crack down on gang stalking. If you were a real police officer doing your job, look at these perps, they need to go to prison. They're perps. I'm gonna, excuse me. Yeah, a real police officer doing your job, you will crack down on gang stalking. But y'all participate in it. Because y'all satanic sellouts. Freemasons. Bullies. Why every see he about to you so into your thing? He caught he, he called fault but without covering his mouth. I'm trying to cough on me without covering your mouth.
so I feel extremely highly traumatized from my jail experience. That police officer was trying to make it like as if she wanted to aggressively more want to throw me in jail. She falsely accused me of confessing to be a gangbanger. She did the reverse. You know, she, when I call her a gang stubber, she falsely accused me of stalking gangbangers. Now, anybody else, when I call them gang stalkers, um, they'd be like, she called me a gangbanger. But, when I call her a gang stalker, she falsely accused me of saying that she stalks gang bangers and falsely, she falsely assumed that I'm a gang banger. And she was gonna more aggressively trying to throw me in jail. Like stupid, what, what kind of gangs they got in Gretna? Cause I damn sure don't know. I, I never been any affiliated by any gang. But that's the kind of psychological games that they try to play. See this Lowe's Hotel? They're abusive over here. They wouldn't let me use the bathroom. It was freaking afternoon. They changed everything. Yep, all these rich, fancy hotels. No hospitality if you're homeless or poor. It's only for the rich with a lot of money. See, why they, why they come and arrive at the same time as me? The fake crusty cabs be gang stalking hard. See, they don't have a license plate. So, my, my, my new phone is cracked and then it won't even charge as quickly as it used to. They fucked up every damn thing. I mean, I had like, a nice bit of either property damage or property loss. In intentional. And y'all falsely accuse me of the criminal mischief? That's what y'all did to me. Come on, please. Just slow down. Well, here's a perk with strange headlights. doggone shame they wrongfully banned me from here and threatened me with jail like you really want to see another black person be tortured in jail you will sell out so i have to do do and i have to be forced to hold my shit in until tomorrow and that's torture and Another perp that just turned that vehicle strange headlights. <laughs> the 
So people even said that the Hilton and a lot of the other hotels are big on the sex trafficking of kids. But y'all want to talk about somebody trespassing? So they bullied and they harassed and gang stalked me out of the river walk. And they had no problem with me for four months. For well, almost four months. Look, strange headlights. Young ass kids. <laughs> so if you wrongfully arrested and got something on your record, people say that that um was still be held against you on a criminal record, you know, well, I mean, I wasn't convicted, you know, so I'm really, I'm, like, I'm highly ignorant of the law, um, I know a little bit of things, but not a lot.